Do-ba-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-
Get, equip it to blend in with bokoblins. Equip it to blend in with moblins. I kind of want to get both. Why am I so bad at doing this efficiently? Give me that moblin mask. Yes. Okay. Um. All right. I'm, I'm going to need more mon. I need more mon. Yep, yep, yep. I'm on it. I'm on it. Mon. What do I got? I got I got key swings. I got a lot of key swings. But that's not going to be enough. Oh, uh, well, those are valuable. Those are valuable. Yes. Um. Let's see. I'm going to need to give you six, I think. Six. Yep, that's perfect. I did it. Okay, now. Now, give me that bokoblin mask. Give me that bokoblin mask. Yeah. Special price of 99 mon? Perfect. Fantastic. I would not. I do not need anything else. I hope to see you again another monstrous night. Well, I hope to take a picture of your creepy, creepy face. Let's try and get your your full get your get your arms in there too because yeah there we go perfect <laughs> all right well this has been an adventure all right so now I just what need to figure out how to get into Gerudo Town <laughs> and um, how to survive the fact that the sun is coming up and it's the desert oh boy. Oh boy. Well, you know what? I'm curious. What happens if I put this on and go to town? I feel like they're going to attack me. But I want to find out. Hi! It's me, a friendly bokoblin. Come to ch chill in your town. I'm not a dude. I'm not a vo. I'm a bokoblin. That's different, right? Savota, Savota yourself. I, I, I know. I know, but okay, sure, I guess you're not fooled. I guess you're not fooled at all. <laughs> I even have the Bokoblin pose. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, this is amazing. Kilton's the best. Okay, um, just for the sake of argument, I'm going to try scaling the wall over here. No, wait, this isn't a good, this isn't a good place to do it because the, around back is where there's no guards, right? Hmm. But I haven't been successful in all in finding how to how to get in there. Have you got have you any progress, Benja? Hey! I hear the man who infiltrated Gerudo Town is frequently traveling between Karakara Bazaar in here. So I'm waiting for him. I plan on asking him how he pulls off his amazing infiltration. My plan is flawless. Okay, okay, so I talked to a guy who travels back and forth between the two places who is not successful. So let's try and talk to somebody who is successful, eh? Starts out with getting myself a sand seal because Oh, you know what? I'm gonna need to I'm gonna need to get elixir. Just a second. I can probably do that once I'm on board. Okay. Okay. Don't mind me. Don't mind me just sneaking up on your sand seals. I'm actually kinda glad you don't react to me having a book cobblin mask on, because that would probably freak out the seals. Perfect. Okay. Great. Now, I need to drink an elixir. Where's my elixirs? Over here. There we go. That, that'll work. Great. Man, look at my floppy ears. This is amazing. This is the best thing. This is the best thing. Uh, uh, anyway, um, looking for people traveling between the towns. Supposedly around here somewhere. Let's see. Let's see, shall we? Maybe dashing is not a good idea. Because I feel like the, the uh, draw distance isn't quite so high that if I come up on him, I'm not going to see him until I'm past him, yeah? Nah, just checking behind me. Seems like we're okay. There's nobody on the path. There is nobody on the path. Also, I can't help but notice that it's not actually that hot out yet. So I kind of wasted my elixir. That's cool. Okay. If I stop here, do you... Oh, you still surfacing? Yep. Dang it. I messed it up. It's getting warm. Who are you? Mm. Lucan. Hmm. You look like your everyday traveler, but how can I be sure? Don't tell anyone, but oh. I'm no merchant. I'm a Gerudo Town soldier in disguise. 
Ever heard, heard the Yiga clan? They're a group of thieving bandits who have caused all sorts of trouble back in town. Yeah, they keep jumping me, actually. It's annoying. I got a tip from some of them to go incognito as travelers to ambush the unwary. In other words, you're a Yiga. Dang it! That's why I'm dressed as a simple merchant. My mission is to blend in and stay on guard in case they strike. No, no, never mind. <laughs> False alarm, carry on. They were bold enough to strike at Gerudo Town, so I wouldn't be shocked if they struck at travelers too. But they wouldn't strike as an innocent Bacoblin. Nobody would do that. Okay, okay, so there's a dude who knows how to get in there. Gotta find the dude who knows how to get in there. Um... I don't see anybody out of the ordinary here. I feel like I've talked to everybody here. Can't help but notice you still haven't gotten more melons in there. Vendor lady. But I'm not talking to you because you're a jerk. Okay. Okay. Yes, hello, Beetle. Uh, well, maybe you should, um, not hang out in the desert all the time. I don't know. As well as everywhere else in the world simultaneously. Okay. Okay, uh... There is nobody new here. I am wasting time. Dang it! Yeah, it's, it's been two days now. I still don't believe you. Unless you just keep putting out new identical stuff every day, in which case, good on you. Okay, um... Oh, you know, I haven't talked to the guard guy while he's been light out. Let's, let's talk to him. Hey, Nobiro. Hey! <laughs> That's your... Oh, look at your face! Look at his face! A treasure, a treasure hidden inside a sandstorm by an ancient civilization. Sounds like an adventure just waiting to happen. Mm. They say the sandstorm lets up for a few hours each day, but I haven't seen it settle down for even an instant. Any shifty merchants? Shifty merchants? Sorry, no idea what you're talking about. The only thing I'm interested in right now are the sandstorm and the treasure hiding inside its storming sands. That's all you have to say? And that brings me to my next point. Who are you? <laughs> fair fair question. Fair question. <laughs> okay. Um, thanks, Nobiro. That was enlightening. Uh, let's talk to this guy again. Aww. Our boss, I get the feeling that he isn't coming back from Gerudo time any, anytime soon. I hope he's okay. A man snuck in, yes. Mm -hmm. What? There's a man who got into Gerudo town? And the boss says he comes here to the Karakara Bazaar. I guess it must be true if the boss said so. But I've never seen anyone around here who strikes me as a super sneaky guy. There was that pretty Hylian gal at the general store. It's unusual to see a Hylian girl dressed like a Gerudo. What general store? Her Gerudo clothes. I wonder where she bought them. Maybe if I wore those clothes. <laughs> nah. I'm so out of my element with all this sneaky stuff. General store. There's a general store? Are there doors in this place that I haven't noticed? What is that? There's a there's an emblem in the middle of the lake. What's what's going on with that? Car car bazaar general store. Okay, okay. Now I feel like we're getting somewhere. No, not you. You're not Hylian, unless you're just really well disguised. Okay, well, let's talk to the general store owner. No, I don't want your steak. I don't want your tail. Wait, it's just a tail? It's just a raw tail? What the heck, Mike? Mike? Is it is it pronounced Mike? Mike, talk to me. Mm? You want to know if I've seen a suspicious-looking male merchant? Mm. Suspicious, huh? Hmm. Mm. Nah, I don't know. It's hard to say. I spend all my time right here, and I don't know how I'd tell if someone was a merchant. Anyway, there are Hylian merchants here, too. Why don't you go ask one of them? Okay. My little sister runs a butcher ta shop over in Gerudo Town. She's traveled all over, so she knows your language pretty well. You should. I mean, we've already talked about this. I'm a vo. Yes. Check. Got it. Um, Hylian. You're a Hylian. Talk to me. Don't be shy, ladies. Oh, it's Garten again. <laughs> Kicking back in the car, car bazaar. I don't remember the voice I gave you. It's been a day. I'm sorry. Make it small talk with the lovely Gerudo. Good times, good times. Hey, don't get me wrong, it's all part of the job. You have to make friends to make money. Want some apples? Emporium's open. I don't want anything you got. Get out of here. I will not. Okay, what's oh uh, you're that's that's a that's a Gerudo. She cannot help me. Probably Hylian merchant. Hylian merchant. Um 
Let's see here. Same to you. Uh, come to think on it, it gave me a quest when I found out I couldn't get in here, right? Let's see here. Forbidden City Entry. Try to locate some people who know his whereabouts. Okay, okay. I'm on it. I can talk to the cranky old lady again. There's a dog. Hey, wait, wait a second. Who are you? Oh, this is another ice shack, isn't it? Oh, it's Ronson. I already talked to you. Savota. I'm still considering how to continue my search. I mastered. Yep, 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 yep. But up, up, up. Don't care. Don't care. All right. What's in here? Um. No, I've talked to you guys. Kenora. Savota. The Divine Beast. Yep, yep. I don't have anything else to say to you. Okay, I need to find a Hylian. That much is clear. I love that I keep snorting as I walk around. This is this mask is the best thing I've ever bought. And I'm sorry if it's annoying to you, but not sorry enough to take it off. Let's uh let's get up top. Get up top, get up top. Haven't been up top before. Maybe there'll be someone up here who can help me. Ooh, 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 ooh. This seems this seems like exactly what I need. Hee hee hee. Vilia, you are a Hylian dude. You're not fooling anyone. Oh my, what a lovely young lad you are. Do you need something from me? You're a dude. Mm -hmm. What's that? You've heard about a man who, who snuck into Gerudo Town. Mm. Oh, I don't know anything about him. Sorry I couldn't be more help. <laughs> Squint suspiciously. I don't believe you. <laughs> You're making my chief swarm looking at me like that. You're a man. Mm. Oh my, you say, sure say the funniest things, young man. Anyway, if you don't need anything, you should be off then. Mm. Well, well, you still haven't given up on your search for the man who snuck into Gerudo Town? I told you I didn't know anything. Don't you, do you always doubt someone's word? All right. Mm. All right, well, let's, let's compliment them. See if flattery gets me anywhere. That's a great approach. Oh, such a nice thing to say! And I'm sure you'd agree that these clothes only help my looks, right? Now that I think about it, this style would look quite fetching on you. I'd have to charge you, of course, but I bet people would see you completely differently if you wore them. This is exactly what I needed! What do you think? Do you want to buy them for 600 rupees? Yes! Oh. It's a deal, then. I'll take your rupees now. <laughs> I have the perfect outfit for you. Go ahead and change into it right now. Don't worry. I'll look away. Sure you will. Sure you will. Oh, man. <laughs> that noise he just made. <laughs> Oh, you look adorable! Oh. <laughs> just look, just as I thought, you make for quite a good-looking gal. That's a traditional Gerudo outfit. It's such a striking look around here, I doubt anyone would even suspect you're a man. On top of that, it breathes so well that it'll sure to be sh it'll sh it's sure to help you deal with the desert heat, at least a little. Man, this is perfect. I have achieved all my goals in one. Mm. I'm so glad I was able to help you out. If you're free to grab something to eat sometime, keep me in mind. Whoa. Oh. Do you have a white beard? You might have a white beard. <laughs> Make sure you watch out for the wind. <laughs> Good advice. Thanks, Vilia. Oh. If you want to get more ladies' clothing, come back any time. Wait, what else do you offer? Talk to me. Talk to me. What else do you have? Oh. The giant monster cloaked in a sandstorm. If I recall correctly, it's called a Divine Beast. I hear it started wandering Garuda Desert several weeks ago. I wonder what it is exactly. Just several weeks ago? Well, that's kind of surprising. Apparently, the chief of Garuda Town is having a lot of trouble figuring out how to handle the situation. One thing's for sure. They'd be helpless if the Divine Beast headed for town. That being said, you look adorable. With those clothes, anyone around here might think you were a nice girl. And not a dude with sword. Where the sword? I mean, they carry swords around here anyway, that's not unusual. But, I'm not very nice, that's the thing. That's the thing here. I tend to kill a lot of things. Yes, I do. Okay, so is this three parts? Is this three parts of equipment? Let me just, uh... It is. And it's very low armor. Cool. 
Cool. All right, good to know. Um, I guess let's get a move on. And I don't need the rest of those heat, those um, heat elixirs either. So that's great too. All right, back to Gerudo Town with me. Let's go infiltrate some places I'm not supposed to go. Yeah, that other guy who came by here, who carried the same weapon as me, I uh, I killed him and took his stuff. That is what happened. You know. Filthy Vo, you know how it is. Sometimes they just get uppity and you gotta kill them and take their stuff, I guess? Yeah, that's that's the deal. Ugh, man, I wish I had a sand seal that it would hang around when I get to town. Maybe if I don't steer them directly at the rocks, I'd have better luck. I'll have to work on that in the future. Oof, oof, long way, long way. Um, in retrospect, I should have fast forwarded this bit, shouldn't I? <laughs> <laughs> Why should you have to watch this? Okay, well, I'll talk to that person to make this a little more interesting. It's probably gonna be someone I already talked to, but I'll give it a shot. Oh, I remember you. I remember you. Still in disguise, eh? Me too now. Savak! Mm -hmm. Don't blame me if you go wandering in the deserts and Naboros' lightning strikes you down. We Gerudo know better than to go anywhere near that thing. Mm. I heard our chief might be doing something about Naboros, but until she does, be smart and stay away. You got it. I will do exactly that. Savak. Um, who's that? Everybody's running for the town. Are you chasing that guy? Okay, I'm curious now. What's going on? I, can I get there any, oh. How do I, how do I, there it is, there it is. There we go. That's a little faster. All right. Hey, dude. What's going on? Oh, it's Garten again. That's less interesting. How did I... Hey! Did you get a load of that giant stompy monster? Who'd brave the desert with that thing around? I change your voice every time. On the other hand, I gotta get to know those Garudi, Gerudo ladies better. I think I'll just chance it to make a mad dash for town, which is what you're doing, huh? Good luck with that. And... Oh, it's Kira. Savak. Pretty clothes. You don't see my kinswoman wearing that style often. I bet it drives Vo out of the world, out in the world wild. I'm at the perfect age to travel and see what the world holds myself, but I've barely explored this desert. Mm. Adventures won't come and find me, I know. I have to put myself out there. I like staying around the familiar, I guess. You, though. You should see the world, meet new people. Maybe you'll meet a nice Vo. Savork. Savork. That's different. Savork, traveler. I'll have to remember that one. Savork. Got it. Okay. So you're just going to try and charge the gates? I kind of am curious to see what happens. No? You're not going to? Okay, well, less interested. Hi! Savak. Savak. We don't get a lot of Hylian Vi around here. Welcome to Gerudo Town. It's an old tradition that only Vi are allowed within the walls. Vo are strictly forbidden. Take your time here. Okay, thanks. Here's a tip. If you stop by the canteen, do yourself a favor and order a noble pursuit. It's hands down the best drink I've ever had. Hmm. I will take- I will make a note of that. Hey, Dora. Savak. Savak. This is Gerudo Town, Hyrule's largest trade hub. Only Vi are permitted entry within the walls, and we're constantly on alert for anyone who looks suspicious. I- oh. Since you're here, it might be worth it to learn some Gerudo words, right? Goodbye is Savork. Okay, that's good to know. Great. Savork is goodbye. I got it. Savak Savork. Hello. Savak. Savak. Fegrin. Even with the divine beast out there making a fuss, a little vi just like you just strolls into town. You've done well to make it to Gerudo Town. Mm -hmm. The chief keeps saying that everything is going to be okay, but thinking about the divine beast makes me so uneasy. Talk to me about the chief. I'm a stranger. Oh. This town is led by our fantastic chief, Lady Riju. She became chief after her mother, our old chief, passed away. Though young, Lady Riju was our old chief's only child, so naturally the duties of leading the Gerudo fell to her. There have been other troubles on top of the Divine Beast acting violently. I hear it has the Chief and her advisors pretty worried. Okay, talk to me about the Divine Beast. Mm. You crossed the Gerudo Desert to get here, right? So you must have seen the giant walking out around outside. Mm. It appeared suddenly a few weeks ago. It's a daunting sight. If you get too close to it, it'll latch out to you with lightning. I can't imagine what would happen if it came to town. Oh, probably everyone would die. The Chief says that... Uh, excuse me. <clears throat> that thing used to be a god who protected this area around 100 years ago. But that story sounds too crazy to believe, don't you think? I need to think on it. Okay. Cool, thanks, Fegrin. 
Well, I'll just try and keep my spirits up. Maybe visit the canteen and then get a good night's sleep. Seems like a fine plan. A fine plan. Man, look at all these people. Okay, hang on. Oh, this is the... Please see the front desk for all requiring... Inquiries regarding the renting of seals. Renting of seals. Maybe that would be one that doesn't run away. Also, looting? Hey! Free money? Maybe? Maybe I shouldn't just steal stuff from people when I come to their town, disguised as a woman, so that they don't throw me out immediately. But you know what? I've not had that kind of common sense so far, so why would I start now? Okay, let's, uh... I'm gonna just... Whoops, that's not what I meant. That's not what I meant. I meant to... That. Here, get out of here. I'm taking this new one. They'll never know the difference. The front desk. Where's the front desk, though? Up here? Oh, whoops, whoops, I get it, I get it. Hello. Savak, I mean. Essa, hello. I mean Savak, dang it. The sand seals here were all trained by Freli. They're faster and they'll wait for you to return to them. By comparison, the ones outside who haven't been trained will just run off the moment you dismount. It's definitely worth renting, worth renting a trained one. Freli really... <coughs> wow, I can't talk. Freli puts her heart into training them. Freely trained the sand seals used in the sand seal races, too, of course. Oh, tell me about that. Sand seal races. The sand seal races are a Garuda tradition. It's pretty simple. You use a sand seal to race around a course to see who's the fastest. Just go out the southeast gate of the town and head to the right. You'll see the starting line immediately. No harm in taking a peek, right? That is true. Whoops. Whoops. Okay. Okay. Um. Jeez, I, I can't even steer now. This is... Oh! <laughs> Wait a second, this is the wrong side of the front desk. Let's see here. What's that sign say? Nothing. There's nobody here. Hi. What's Freli? Fasak yourself. If you're hoping to cross the vast Gerudo Desert, sand seal surfing is the way to do it. It's only 20 rupees to rent one. Need a shield too? Just pay 50 rupees. What do you say? Sand seal? Seriously? Look at all these puns. Let's seal the deal. How do I set seal? See you later. Seal you later? Okay. Seriously. <laughs> sand seals are animals native to Gerudo Desert Gateway. It's quite dangerous to cross the desert on foot, but you have a sand seal, you'll breeze right along. Okay, I've talked about this before. I am going to seal you later. Is that some kind of slang? I wonder if it's just a thing outside Gerudo Town. Anyway, the Gerudo Desert is vast. You'd be wise to take a sand seal if you're traveling beyond town. You're right, I would, but I'm not doing that thing, so why am I going this direction? Ha <laughs> ha! Good question. Good question. Um, hey, what's in here? Let's just, you know, walk around the place like I own it. Like I do. Well, this is just quarters, eh? Is this a ladder? It looks like it's a ladder, but I can't use it, so... Effectively, no. Alright. Hop. Cool. Let's, um... Hey, what, what's uh, what's going on here? Hello? Vasak? Sala. Hey. Ooh, that Gerudo top looks really good on you. But you haven't really lived until you've got several colors to choose from. What do you say? Uh, what do you got? You don't know, really? <laughs> Changing the color of your clothes is a really trendy thing to do right now for young Vi traveling beyond town. There's a store in Hatano Village, the Kochi dye shop, where you can dye your clothes. You know, I never went there. I should probably do that at some point, huh? Harano Village is pretty far away, though. Not everyone gets to go there. Anything else you need? Um, no thank you. It's really hot today, isn't it? Makes me want to get a good, an ice-cold something from the canteen. Okay, what's the deal? Oh, this is just, like, if I throw away my clothes or something? Yep, yep, looks like it. It's uh, slightly cheaper here in town, isn't it? Slightly cheaper. Well... I guess the first ones are more expensive, that's just kind of how it works. Fashion Passion. You named your... You named your store in Hylian. Okay, sure, why not? Okay, you sell mushrooms. Let's talk to you, though, rather than to your goods. Savak! Oh, you're less friendly, okay. Savak! It's another hot one today, huh? Um... You, you guys hate it when I sell you stuff, and I don't have anything to sell anyway. Just between us, the Gerudo keep their skin so beautiful thanks to the mushrooms that grow here. It would really be a waste if you left Gerudo Town without taking some of these mushrooms with you. Alright, cool, thanks. Thanks for the advice. 
I will uh, bear your skincare tip in mind. What's in here? Hmm. Somebody is asleep. Hey, wake up. Hey, wake up. I'm in your house. Ugh, what is it? I prefer to rest and relax until night. Okay, Nelly. Sorry. All right. Cool. Um. Let's see. Hey, there's a Goron. Hello, Goron. Ooh. Uh, Savak. That V sounds really tricky to master. I feel like I got it there, though. Linde. Uh. Gerudo Town really is full of women, isn't it? Mm. It really smells nice here. Mm. Hang on. I thought men weren't allowed in this town. Why did they let me in? I was kind of wondering that myself. Do they... Are there... I've never... I guess I can't distinguish between Goron men and women. Anything else to say? Nope, nope. Cool. Alright. Well, maybe they just can't tell either. <laughs> oh, hey, Arito. Hello. Frida. Good day. I really want to use the actual Gerudo greeting. You know, Savak. But I'm worried I'd mess it up and embarrass myself. You know, like... Look at me! I can speak another language! It just feels like bragging. Don't overthink it. Don't overthink it. You really think I'm putting too much thought into it? Maybe you're right. Gerudo Town is so different from home. I live in Rito Village. We don't get many visitors there, so I'm not really familiar with non-Rito. But now that I'm here, I should enjoy myself. I wanted to start by trying out some of the meat here, but, uh... Well, they don't seem to have poultry. So you only eat... You only eat poultry, huh? Well, I guess. Carnivorous birds and all that. Hello! Whoa! That's a really big voor! Voor? Voor? Is that what you guys call Ritos? Is she particularly... Maybe that's just the word for bird. That could just be what is going on here. Oh, hey, look at the time. All right, well, it's sweet. So we're, we're in Gerudo Village. We made that part. Gerudo Town. I keep calling it Gerudo Village, but I think it's Gerudo Town. I don't know why I keep doing that. Regardless, we're here, um, and next time we'll talk to the Chief and maybe try and get a little headway on this whole Divine Beast situation. And although I did get some clothing that, uh, <laughs> should allow me to tolerate the heat, I don't know how excited I am to wear this when I try and fight that guardian on the volcano. But hey, I guess, <laughs> I guess we'll deal with that when we come to it. So, thank you for watching, and, uh, yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye!